Welcome to the Natural Health Show with one of New England's leading holistic specialists, Mark Mincola. Call Mark at 617-822-1969 on 96.9 Boston Talks. Greetings and welcome home, Natural Health Nation, and a very happy, healthy, special Mother's Day wish to all qualifiers out there, and we'd like to uh, also welcome Catherine Foley from Jara Formulas. Welcome. Good afternoon. And where where the heck have you been? <laughs> you know, I've been working a lot and traveling a lot. <laughs> Always traveling. Yes. Um, Washington, D.C. of late, yes? Yes. We were at a medical conference um, this week with Jaro Formulas, and the conference was the American College of Obstetricians and Gynecologists, so we were um, talking to some folks about uh, the use of probiotic bacteria, like lactobacillus, for... Uh, Good bacteria. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it was a wonderful opportunity um, to reach out to these doctors and share a little bit of the knowledge that we have with them. So you've got the latest information regarding probiotics, and, uh, you know, it seems to me uh, that the world of medicine is finally coming around and really acknowledging, recognizing, and tuning in to the fact that probiotics uh, are really remarkable difference makers when it comes to floral health in the body. Well, you know, the fact of the matter is is that we have what they call a symbiotic relationship with bacteria in nature, and um, the bacteria provide lots of different you know, nutrients for us, protection, Mm -hmm. uh, all sorts of things. And if we have healthy populations of them, we are healthy. And, you know, that's the definition of a symbiotic relationship. Right. And so many folks, I think, are are starting to, again, become more aware of the fact that uh, it's not just about antibiotics, you know, waiting until you get a bacterial infection and then using an antibiotic, which has all kinds of ramifications, plus and minus for so many of us. But it's really about uh, preserving and protecting and really building up the good colonies of protective bacteria that we have in our body uh, long before that bacterial infection ever has a chance to knock us out. Right, you know, and and as very simply as it can be stated, um, you know, two of the doctors were talking to each other in front of us and, you know, one saying to the other in amazement, you know, that, you know, basically what happens is, you know, these bacteria colonize the tissue and, you know, as long as they're there, bad bacteria can't get through. And it's really as simple as that. It is as simple as that. Absolutely. <laughs> but the the results and the impact on not only women's health, but public health is tremendous. So, in able to do something just very, very simple, the results that you get from just very simple, basic nutrition, it, it's its overwhelming. Well, you know, and I think so many moms, I mean, I meet with so many people all week long. I had like, you know, 50, 60 appointments a week, and yeah. so many moms come in, and they are super aware now. Moms are really, really tuned into this idea that, you know, instead of the merry-go-round, the antibiotic mm-hmm. merry-go-round, infection after infection, so many of the kids are, you know, they go from one infection to the other, and it's like the antibiotics are, of course, helpful on mm-hmm. the spot, mm-hmm. but they they so compromise the child's immunity in many cases that they leave them susceptible to the next bug. Right. And so many moms are starting to tune in to the difference that probiotics, good bacterial probiotics, can make in their lives. So, you know, we're seeing, uh, we're, we're witnessing evidence in, in all of our lives, and, and I think that medicine, it's great that it's come around and it's starting to pay close attention to the value of probiotics as right. preventive agents. Right. You know, and we'll talk, you know, a little bit more about the the Jaro product, which is called Femdophilus. And I'm interested also in hearing more about some of the latest research because yeah. you just came back from from Washington, D.C. Amazing. And uh, there's a lot going on. Yeah, and there's, there's reasons why we pick certain bacteria. You know, there's reasons why certain bacteria are chosen for women's health as opposed to certain right. bacteria chosen for digestive mm-hmm. health. So that's and really And children important. as well. And for children as well, there's different bacteria, um, you know, that's targeted. Different strains of good bacteria for right. all these, you know, and again, you, you may you may target a different strain for uh, vaginal infections yeah. versus an inner ear infection for a child yes. or whatever. So uh, really important to know the difference from one culture to the next. And we'll talk about that in, you know, further detail about the specific strains, because I think that's what we realized there's a lot of misconception about in talking to, you know, a lot of these doctors and just conversation um, that, 
there really are not a lot of bacteria in yogurt <laughs> anymore because we pasteurize our yogurts and right. You know, unless the yogurts are very specific yogurts like um, like Activa, Activa, which have active cultures, Bifidus regularis, you know, and it has a strain number on it. So, you know, a little bit of discussion about that and in knowing, you know, when to apply the probiotics um, for specific health benefits. Well, and then you've got a lot of folks, of course, that have dairy allergies, and yeah, then and yeah. then the other part of the equation is that the amount of uh, the population of uh, good bacteria in a serving of, of active yogurt high. is about fifty thousand. Yeah. You know, you're looking at uh, in many of the natural supplements that we're talking about anywhere from five to twenty billion, fifty right. billion. Right. Right. So quite a difference. And you know, the yogurts have lots of sugars now, so this is something that we don't really want too much exposure to that you talk about a lot. She is Catherine Foley from Jar of Formulas, of course. My name is Mark Mincol. You're listening to The Natural Health Show. And, of course, The Natural Health Show is heard only on 96.9 Boston Talks, New England's leading talk radio network. And when we come back from this break, we're going to take your calls in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call to style pound 96.9. We'll be right back. Wake up and connect. Wake up and connect with NECN's Morning News. I'm Eric Weber. I'm Leslie Gatiss. Thanks for joining us. The latest news, weather, and traffic. The best way to start your day. Watch it. Watch it. Hear it. Hear it. NECN's Morning News. 4.30 till Jim and Marjorie at 6. On 96.9 Boston Talks. Hi, this is Laura from Good Health. Like Good Health Natural Foods, many of the farms we work with are family-owned and operated. For them, as with us, farming and fresh, healthy food is more than a business. It's a passion. Good Health takes great pride in offering only 100% organic produce. We believe supporting local farmers is good for the community, the environment, and all of our families. Good Health partners with the largest organic co-op in New England, and our farms cultivate a diverse assortment of crops each season. Berries, pears, melons, corn, carrots, and spring greens are just some of our delectable offerings. So visit Good Health in Quincy and Hanover today. Try our organic fruits, veggies, and herbs. Our mission is simple, to bring everything farm to table within hours every day. Let our exceptional staff answer questions and make recommendations on how to prepare and enjoy all our local specialties. For store hours and locations, visit goodhealthnaturalfood.com. Celebrate every season at Good Health. See you soon, and thanks for listening. Tired of one-size-fits-all nutrition and wellness plans? Would you like to have a customized plan for you and you alone? Now you can learn a remarkable bioenergetic system that enables you to effortlessly self-analyze and customize your own nutrition and wellness. Hi, I'm Mark Mincola, New England's leading natural health care expert. Join me for an all-day muscle testing intensive seminar on Saturday, May 14th at the Angels of Light Healing and Intuitive Center in Normal, Massachusetts. Come learn my EMT muscle testing system firsthand. Find out more about your body's bioenergetic strengths and weaknesses and learn how to tailor a nutrition and wellness plan that better suits your body's personalized needs. For more information, call 781-834-2728. That's 781-834-2728 or log on to myhealthylivingmag.com. Come learn to maximize and personalize your wellness. Now back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. In Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless Users, free call pound 969. And, uh, you know, upcoming uh, the 15th of May, next Sunday from 10 to 4 at the Plymouth uh, Expo. We have the Plymouth Expo at Radisson Hotel, Plymouth Harbor. And uh, here to just give us a little bit of insight. And you're not going to believe this. <laughs> Candida is on the line. Candida, how are you? Hey, Catherine. Hi, Mark. How are you? Great. How are you doing? Good. Actually, I was calling to plug your uh, Monday noon lunch and learn program. Oh, well, thank you so much. Go ahead. Tell everybody about it. (laughs) We are so excited. Uh, Folks are suffering from allergies. Mark McCullough is going to present natural alternatives. Tell them about it, Mark. Well, we're going to do a webinar tomorrow, and that's uh, at noon tomorrow. And indeed, we're going to talk extensively about immunity and what folks can do to make a difference naturally with regards to a lot of the allergenesis. It's only a one-hour program, and Candida, you put a great webinar program together for 20 
12 months, and it's like $99 for the entire thing. So uh, we've enjoyed doing it so far. We've had some great feedback, had a lot of nice folks in the line. And and yep. uh, tomorrow is uh, is going to be the, the very focus that we just spoke of. It's going to be allergenesis and managing those allergies naturally. Some great strategy. We get into real detail over that hour. And uh, I look forward to it. It's going to be great fun. Me too. It's astounding. The statistics right now, one in five Americans suffer from food allergies. That is correct. Yes, indeed. And we've, oh, we're talking so about uh, s- somewhere between 80 and 85 million Americans suffering from food allergies that are immune globulin G allergies. So we're not just talking about what's floating around out there and getting up your nostrils. We're talking about what's on the dinner plate as well, folks. So allergenesis, really important issue. Lot of uh, very important strategies that we're going to share that are natural strategies as we do each and every week here. So it should be fun uh, tomorrow at noon. And folks can contact who? They can contact Candida, 781-834-2728. Yes, indeed. And uh, while, we, while we talked about it earlier, too, the Plymouth Expo you've got coming up next Sunday, May 15th from 10 to 4. Tell us about that a little bit. Oh, we're so excited. We have probably about 30, 35 wellness, health, and uh, professionals, fitness, recreational. We have some green folks that will be there. It's going to be fun. We just heard from the Kropala Center. They're going to be giving away a five-day detox retreat for one lucky winner, so oh it's going to be fun. Should be great fun. fun. So, again, if folks are interested in the Plymouth Expo, hey, nice time of year to be out and about checking those kind of things out. That's right. Down at the Radisson Hotel, Plymouth Harbor, 180 Water Street in Plymouth. And uh, that's going to be next Sunday, May 15th, from 10 to 4. So, still gives you plenty of time to turn on the car radio and listen to the Natural Health Show. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can put both together. You can uh, actually get your chops up down at the uh, Plymouth Expo and uh, then complete the day by listening to the Natural Health Show. And uh, (laughs) Catherine Foley knows the, the truth value of listening to the natural yes, health show. absolutely. <laughs> yeah, the muscle testing class is going to be really amazing, too. I mean, people can learn your whole system. Indeed. We're doing that next Saturday. Yes, it's That's next Saturday the 14th. We're doing that. So, folks interested in learning my uh, system, and we can also uh, have them check in with you as well. 781-834-2728. Sounds good. Hey, thanks. Have a good night. Thanks. Have a great night. Thank you, Candy. All right, bye-bye. And uh, again, our telephone numbers here for folks who have you got questions about natural health issues, vitamins, minerals, probiotics, what strains to use for various conditions, etc. Hey, that's what we're here for. And our telephone numbers in Boston, New England, 617 822 1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call just out pound 969. Let's get to uh, Bruce on the line from Walpole. Welcome to 969 Boston Talks from the Natural Health Show. How you doing, Mark? Terrific, Bruce. How are you? I, I listen to your show all the time, and uh, I'm, I'm very healthy. I, I work out every day. Um, I haven't had meat or dairy in about 30 years. Yep. And uh, I eat chicken and fish. I was just diagnosed recently with hyperparathyroidism. Um, I'm try- I asked the doctor to explain to me how it came about, and I wasn't really satisfied with his lack of explanation. I've had a bone scan. I've had ses- just recently a Sestamibi scan. I want to know if there's something short of surgery that they're going to ultimately recommend that I could do to bring down the calcium levels in my blood. Yeah, well, there's a couple things. First of all, to me, that's more of an autoimmune problem. You know, in other words, you're, the error is happening within your own system. It's um, kind of like overkill. It's when your body gets overactive, uh, your endocrine system kind of uh, fails by kind of uh, getting too efficient or too overproductive or too overactive, I should say, in some areas. And in this case, what ends up happening is you're pretty a high level of thyrocalcitonin. The levels are just too high. And again, you know, to me, adrenal glands tend to trigger a lot of that stuff. So folks, you know, there's two nervous systems here that really drive all your chemistry. You've got the sympathetic and parasympathetic, or if you will, stra- stress response or relaxation response. If if you tend to be kind of running a little bit high, a little bit, uh, a little bit adrenally, uh, you know, in many cases, you're going to put yourself in a position where you're more susceptible to these autoimmune uh, uh, responses. So I would say that you're over producing thyrocalcitonin, and there's a little too much uh, calcium work going on in there. So a couple things that I think of. Number one, there's been some interesting uh, some interesting research in the area of lemon balm, lemon balm, B-A-L-M. Lemon balm tincture actually has, a, has uh, shown some positive results there. I'd say like 20 drops, three ounces of water, three times a day. I also think magnesium is a really important part of the equation to try to slow down some of that adrenaline, some of that adrenal response that triggers a lot of that autoimmune immune excess. So I would tell you to use a magnesium taurate because 
Torates a nerve membrane stabilizer, so too is magnesium. And generally, you're going to, you're going to find that in 125 milligram uh, doses. So I'd tell you to just t take two of those in the morning, two of those in the afternoon for a total of 500 milligrams of magnesium. Finally, uh, Jaro Formulas makes a great MK7. I knew you were going to say that. And MK7, <laughs> of course, plays traffic cop with yeah. your calcium. It says, hey, you're not allowed to uh, to dump and deposit. you got to go right to the bones and be productive. So MK7, they make 90 micrograms, yeah. I'd say two a day in your case on an empty stomach. I think that's uh, probably a good way to do it. Is this, is this something that may, I might be able to prevent the surgery if I stay on this for uh, a period, or should I take this indefinitely? Well, you know, you need to consult with your team of practitioners, obviously, and uh, yeah. make sure that you've got somebody who can represent you from the standpoint of alternative and uh, somebody who knows what they're doing as, as one of your health care uh, team members. But uh, I'm not, you know, I'm not uh, privy to knowing how advanced your condition is, obviously, et cetera. But yeah. you certainly want to look into these possibilities and bring them into, this, into the uh, discussion because... Uh, these are real good ways to try to manage the, the problem from a natural standpoint. Okay. All right. I appreciate your time. Thank Bruce, you. Bruce, best wishes. Take care of yourself. Again, our telephone numbers here in Boston, New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call, just dial pound 96.9. We're here to take your questions regarding nutrition, vitamins, minerals, natural health, weight loss, etc. Before we get back to your calls, I want to talk with Catherine mm -hmm. for a minute here. Catherine, we, we were talking about um, MK7, the importance of right. directing calcium in the, right, uh, in the right way in the body, because calcium can really become a problem. Most, most folks are thinking thinking of calcium is only a good thing. Well, you know, the reason why, um, you know, your your body stores calcium in the bone tissue is to to keep it out of the bloodstream. You know, your your bone tissue is your body's natural store of biominerals, and biominerals in the blood are so tightly regulated that, you know, any excesses will result in loss of extra calcium from the bone and all of this stuff. So... Your blood is very, very tightly regulated. Yep. Your body does not want to see too much going on in there. That's right. So, you know, if we start dumping a lot of calcium into our bodies and our serum calcium levels go up, there's going to be a physiological response to you that. Bet. And it's a spilling of your natural stores. So, you know, I always ask people if they say, I need calcium. I The first question I always ask them is, is why are you taking calcium? If they're taking calcium for bone health, then I gear them towards a bone formula sure. that will have vitamin K in yep. it. Um, you know, like I said, if you're taking calcium and it, it's not formulated for bone health, then you're not getting the help that you're not getting the advantage of the product. Well, and another important point, too, that we might have mentioned in that last call is that pH is an important issue. So many folks who True. are running very acidically, their body are very, very, very acid yeah. because of the stress component that we mentioned, you know, the adrenal stress response, the body gets very acidic during stress. Yeah. And uh, when folks are chronically stressed and the adrenals are chronically uh, overactive, over-involved, yeah. uh, there's more fight-or-flight chemistry that, that, that tends to produce a higher level of acidosis in the body. Yeah. And then the body kind of is forced to become overcompensational by, right. by producing too much calcium regulation right. to try you know, to buffer the body. Yeah, and it's the same way if, you know, you have an acid stomach, what do you do? You take a Tums, and exactly. if your blood is acid, what does your body yep. do? It, it does the equivalent, which is dumps calcium to Absolutely buffer, true. buffer All right. the solution. Let's grab a call or two here. we got Laura from Plymouth. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talk Show in the Natural Health Show. Hey, thank you for taking my call. Pleasure. Um, you know, about two years ago, I developed rosacea, or I became aware that I had rosacea. Mm -hmm. I think I had it for quite a while before I became aware of it. And um, I'm on Oratia, which is a low-dose antibiotic, but I'd really like to try something more natural. Um, and I just was wondering if you guys had any suggestions. Catherine, why don't you grab that? Yeah, I mean, I would definitely start with um, a healthy probiotic. You know, they, they often say um, the health of the skin is directly related to the health of the intestinal The seventh tract. major eliminative organ after all your right. internal stuff gets blocked up or backed up or yeah. has any kind of stress trying to relieve itself of toxins is the skin. Yeah, and increased fatty acids, um, flax oil, you know, all of those things. And when it comes to topical products, oh, you have to be so basic with yeah. topical products. Um, you know, I mean... 
using like jojoba oil as a moisturizer. Really, really simple kind of stuff. Well, I'd like to go back to your first suggestion, the idea of a probiotic, like we talked about at the outset of the broadcast, the idea of a good bacteria. So, you know, you mentioned an important uh, point, which is that there are many different cultures. So if, if Laura were looking for a natural approach to support the, uh, the rosacea from an, an anti-inflammatory bacterial uh, program, uh, what, what culture might be beneficial for her? She's going to look for a blend that has a healthy balance between lactobacillus bacteria and bifidobacteria. Yeah. Um, the bifidobacteria are the immune system regulators. So recommend a a jarro formula. <laughs> we, we have um, a product called Bifido Balance, which is a jarro formulas product that is primarily bifidus bacteria, and that is going to help to regulate inflammatory cytokines and all of those things that modulate and work the immune system in the intestinal tract. So Bifido Balance by Jarro Formulas, Laura. Thank you very much. And what about turmeric? I've heard about that, and I just was wondering if you had any thoughts on yeah, that. Tur turmeric is a, is a great anti-inflammatory by nature. So, again, you're dealing with an inflammatory condition. Why not? Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Thanks right. a lot. Best. Take care. All right, we're going to uh, get out of here for just a message or two, and then we'll be right back with your questions. And uh, our telephone number is once again in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, free call, pound 96.9. Play it again. Audio on demand. Broadcasting now at 96.9. BostonTalks.com. Do you own or manage a natural health, fitness, day spa, or go green business? Perhaps you have a unique restaurant that offers healthy entrees, heart-smart seafood, vegetarian, or lighter fare options. I invite you to share your vision and deliver your message directly to health-conscious New Englanders by becoming a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, New England's number one health radio show. The Natural Health Show is now welcoming potential sponsors to join our natural health family by offering a number of creative and flexible sponsorship packages. For information on how to become a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, simply call Candida at 781-834-834. 2728. That's 781 834 2728. Be a part of New England's natural health revolution. Join our natural health show family today. There are many things we cannot control in life. The one thing we can control is how we choose to take care of ourselves. Hi, this is Mark Mincola, New England's leading natural health care expert. Join me for my monthly live webinars. The key in making your health a priority is becoming educated on how your body works and how to make it work for you. We're continually listening to our valuable feedback, and the one thing that requests most of us is to provide more cutting-edge educational motivational tools. Join me for my monthly live webinars as I educate individuals on how to work nutrition and overall health permanently into their lifestyle. We understand that even with the power of the Internet, it is still difficult to find health information that is relevant, backed by science, understood, and can be implemented into your lifestyle. My live nutrition webinar series takes place on the first Monday of each month at 12 noon. For only $99, you can participate in all 12 webinars. For more information, log on to MyHealthyLivingMag.com or call 781-834-2728. That's 781-834-2728. The brain requires nutrition just like the rest of the body. Although many of us depend upon caffeine for focus and concentration, caffeine is not actually a nutrient. Real nutrition is needed to enhance brain metabolism and provide antioxidant protection. This is where Jaro Formula's Neuro Optimizer comes to the rescue. Neuro Optimizer is a concentrated source of the nutrients needed for memory and mood, for concentration and focus, all without being a stimulant. Neuro Optimizer supplies the building blocks for neurotransmitters, the chemicals that allow cells in the brain to communicate and to file away memories. Acetyl-L-carnitine and alpha-lipoic acid support brain energy production. Phosphatidylserine, L-glutamine, and taurine enhance brain stability and detoxification in the face of stress. Neuro Optimizer is the nutritional answer to the brain's needs. Ask for Neuro Optimizer at your local health food store. Or for more information, go to Jarro.com. That's J-A-R-R-O-W for the best in brain health formulas. Now, back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. In Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, free call, pound 96.9 for your questions. And, uh, you know, one of the things I wanted to mention during one of the earlier breaks, just before we spoke with Candida, 
first of all, Laura Pratt has an amazing voice. Yeah, much I like know. much like you. I mean, you guys have these. Ama- am- you guys ought to be in the stress uh, management uh, uh, <laughs> industry. You know, making tapes or something because you just have those totally relaxed voices. I am available if anybody wants to call me, <laughs> and I'll charge them. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, but, but Laura, yeah. Laura does a great job as well, and she does a great job for all the patrons of Good Health Natural yeah. Foods. And you know, one of the things we wanted to take a second to do is to kind of uh, hats off. Yeah. And give a, a shout out to all the folks at Good Health Natural Foods because it's they, not easy what they do. What they do is difficult, yeah. but do they ever go the extra mile? I yeah. mean, that's the thing that I love about Good Health Natural yeah. Foods. A lot of folks go into health foods and they're lost, yeah. you know, or they're not quite sure about how to get their bearings. They go from shelf to shelf looking confused. I'd right. say seven out of ten people. Um, and Good Health is there to answer questions, to to counsel, to support, um, and to make sure that uh, the consumer is a much better educated consumer by the time they leave there. Well, and also. So, you know, the owners of the, Ralph the and stores, they, um, they value education and they encourage their staff to get trainings and get education. And that is really rare nowadays. So, you know, they support that so much, their staff being... And it, and it makes your job easier as a yeah, rep. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, going in there, you know, any I know any customer that goes in there is going to get the exact product that they need. So they're not going to have to spend a lot of money like going through, you know, different ones to find out the right one for them. They're going to be able to go in there, talk to somebody, and, you know, just like we were talking with the bacteria, yep. they will know the real minute details about yep. every product. Yeah, absolutely true. So uh, we always like to give that special little TLC shout mm-hmm. out to the guys and gals down at Good Health Natural Foods. Hey, let's grab some calls here. We've got Susan on the line from New Hampshire. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talk you're in the natural health show hi how you doing terrific how are you good thanks good um i have a question i was just diagnosed with osteoporosis mm-hmm. and they want me if you ever heard of that um uh reclast that intravenous once yep. a year for mm-hmm. 15 minutes yep. yep what do you think about that is there anything that um i can take that will get the calcium this is supposed to go right to the bone Catherine, you know, yeah. I like the way you talk about the bone matrix and, and the <laughs> silicone and all that stuff. I think uh, Catherine's going to take that. Yeah, Thank well, you. you know, one of the reasons, um, you know, new bone tissue starts off as collagen. And yeah. as the bone tissue grows, your body deposits biominerals into it and it becomes um, hardened bone tissue. It matures. Right. And as we age, collagen production goes down and we start to see osteoporosis. Right pretty much along the same rate that we start to see collagen production decline in the body. So really, to add more minerals on top of a tissue that doesn't have a capacity to hold them, it doesn't really have too much of an effect except for just maintaining. Okay. What we need to do to support new bone growth is to take nutrients that support collagen production. Right. Oh, okay. What do you suggest for that? Um, there's a couple products out there, and they all contain silicon. Okay. And um, Jaro Cell is Jaro Cell Cell S I L. Yep. Is a product out there, and it's biologically active silica, and it has clinical backing to it. So it, you know, there are really good studies out there that show it pr- helps to produce collagen. Oh, and okay. In a fairly short window of time, in too. In a very short win- window of time. Oh, okay. I'll investigate that then. Yeah, and, you know, when you support collagen production, you're also helping to support um, repair and growth of connective mm-hmm. tissue, yep. which is cardiovascular right. tissue, also hair, skin, and nails. Um, yeah. I tell people all the time, listen, we've been calcium, we've been supplementing with calcium for over 20 years, right. but nothing is really happening to our rates of osteoporosis. Right. So there's right. really a lot more going on out there, and yeah. supporting collagen production has really shown that it increases the quality of bone tissue. Right. We keep going after that density, density, density issue, but we really want that good, flexible, spongy, new quality bone My tissue. My favorite analogy that you used years <laughs> ago, and I'll never forget it, is yeah. think about coral and then you think about a hockey puck right, right. grab a hammer and you hit them both one chips one doesn't right. oh. so by strengthening that inner matrix with collagen you're creating hockey puck type bones and not right. coral oh excellent yeah I'll investigate there's that. a visual for you i'd really like to stay natural you know and then have you know something i'm really not familiar with try you know. yeah try jarosil and it's very easy to take it's a liquid um you know 
you can take it twice a day and immediately you'll start to see your hair skin and nails your your nails will grow like crazy so beautiful you know you know it's working it's always Absolutely. good to see that stuff yeah well yeah. thank you both so much all right take care have a great weekend okay all you, right, know, bye-bye. you know mark i i always feel bad saying names like that you know to people and we always say it at the end of the show, but maybe at, in the middle, they can find more information on your website or in podcasts. Yes, indeed. At uh, <laughs> www.maxhealing, one word, maxhealing.com. Thank you so much for that. But it is true. It's loaded with information. Yeah. So there's always a follow-up place for folks who kind of lose track of all the information that flies by during this power-packed hour. Or you can, you know, I mean, we're talking a lot about women's health tonight. Yep. And, you know, if you want to send this information to you know a loved one in your life you can go to your website go on the podcast and just shoot them the link and say hey i heard this and i thought you might be interested absolutely easy enough right. all right let's see uh, we've got uh, annie from revere welcome to 96.9 boston talks you're on the natural health show hi how are you terrific how are you good good um i've had irritable bowel syndrome for mm-hmm. quite a while yep. and i went to see a uh, gastroenterologist specialist about a year or so ago uh at mass general they put me on um a low dosage uh of um disipramin, which is basically an antidepressant which is used for that mm-hmm. um I really, I mean, I don't take any pills other than that. I'm I'm not a pill taker, and um, it makes you gain weight. It also gives you a terrible, terrible taste in your mouth. Um, I'm a water drinker, so I can kind of compensate for that, but still. Anyway, there's a number of things I don't like about it. It does help a little, but I recently saw on Dr. Oz, one of the shows, artichoke, heart, um tea or pills and i ordered some on the website i haven't got them yet i wanted to get your thoughts about that and got, anything else that you think yeah i've got two bits of rec- two bits of uh, support information here two recommendations that i will i will absolutely uh, i feel real confident about giving you and i think that uh, you ought to take these two two tidbits of advice number one i'll give you the easy one jar of formulas makes something called ibs yeah. and ibs is a, a superb superb product for somebody like yourself also I recommend that you go to the website of another friend of the Natural Health Show family here, the idea of, uh, of checking out foodallergy.com. So just go to foodallergy.com, and you'll see the uh, Alatest Medical Labs website. And nobody does a better job than they do. They do an ELISA IgG food allergy test, and it really pins down exactly where your inflammation is coming from so that you can put together a map, a food map, if you will, and uh, follow the directions on your food map, and you'll eliminate the source of the inflammation. So two things, these two things, again, Jaro Formula's IBS supplement, and uh, take it as directed. Also, look at foodallergy.com, Google that, check it out, and uh, try to get in touch and get your your medical team in touch with uh, that group so that we can get you in there for uh, some referred service and uh, get you tested for the immune globulin G food allergy test, and you'll uh, you'll handle this problem very nicely. I've been tested for gluten. I was fine with that. Yeah, that's probably an IgE, and uh, that's about that makes up about one point five percent of all food allergies. We're talking about IgG, and we're talking about eighty million people that have multiplicities of food sensitivities that cause problems such as yours. Okay. All right. Make foodallergy.com. Yeah, foodallergy.com. Make sure you if you get yourself involved in this testing, it's the IG. G, two G's in a row, I-G-G, that's the one you want. Okay, All thank right. you. You're very welcome. And uh, let's see, how are we doing for time, Patrick? We got time for another call? All right, let's uh, grab Anne-Marie from New Hampshire. A lot of New Hampshire calls. Welcome to 96.9 of Boston Talks. You're on the Natural Health Show. Hi. How are you? Good, thank you. Um, I have a question. I've been on 50,000 IUs a week um, because I have low vitamin D. Yep. And I'm wondering, I mean, I got several other uh, problems. I have, like, bursitis I can't get rid of mm-hmm. in my knee. So I'm wondering what I could do for the vitamin D. Catherine, you want to help out on that? Are you, is it, are you on a prescription? Yes, a prescription. Um, well, I mean, your vitamin D levels are going to go up a little bit just because the sunlight is yep. is more this time of year you know right now um but you can continue to supplement with vitamin d jaro makes a vitamin d which is a 5000 iu mm-hmm. um you know and then you know 
fish and, and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, I think one of the important, important things is to make sure that you have efficient assimilation, that you mm -hmm. put something in your body doesn't mean you're going to get the benefit of it. And mm -hmm. making sure that you're synergizing that. Uh, obviously, you know, fatty fish is really an important part of that yeah. equation. Fish oil yeah. okay, supplements. Okay. Someone has mentioned to me a cod liver oil. Would that yep. be also? Yeah, that's a great beneficial? idea. That's that's a very good idea. Absolutely true. And, uh, you know, I think that uh, cod liver oil, just even the omega-3s with the EPA and DHAs, any of those fish oil supplements will make a big difference. Obviously, fatty fish in the diet, like the halibuts and the sa salmons that are right. wild, etc. those are all yes. big difference makers. I think those are going to help you a lot. Oh, okay, so that's a great idea. Thank you. I appreciate You're that. You're very, very welcome. Okay, thank you for listening. <laughs> All right. And, uh, of course, we should take a moment to once again acknowledge the the happy Mother's Day wishes that we want to share with everybody out there. I should wish my mother a happy Mother's Day. Well, go right Day. ahead. Go yes, ahead. You can do Mother's that. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. She <laughs> listens to the show every time I'm on from and ha Arizona. <laughs> happy Mother's Day to everybody out there who, who is a mom. And uh, this is a very special day to recognize some very, very special, special mm -hmm. people out there. So happy, happy Mother's Day to all concerned. And we're going to take a short little break. I'll be right back right after these messages. Friend us on Facebook. Link up at 969bostontalks.com. Go to the Healthy Living Expo in Wellesley on May 21st from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the Wellesley Community Center for a healthy dose of self-exploration and fun. Explore acupuncture, yoga, readings, healing, jewelry, nutrition, Reiki, massage, an outdoor walking labyrinth, and so much more. There's free admittance to the exhibit hall for the whole family. Vendors, to reserve your space, call 781-834-2728 or log on to myhealthylivingmag.com. The Healthy Living Expo helps you bring prosperity, health, and balance to to your life, but you have to show up to make it happen. Visit with Dr. Kimberly Duramo, osteopathic physician from Wellesley Sports Medicine. Learn about osteopathic manipulative medicine, a medical specialty which uses gentle manipulation to bring the body into improved alignment and health. At the expo, Dr. Duramo will present where wellness comes from, tap into the source of your vitality, and she'll be available for questions the entire day. Stop by the Healthy Living Expo in Wellesley on May 21st from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the Wellesley Community Center. For more info, visit MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Tired of one-size-fits-all nutrition and wellness plans? Would you like to have a customized plan for you and you alone? Now you can learn a remarkable bioenergetic system that enables you to effortlessly self-analyze and customize your own nutrition and wellness. Hi, I'm Mark Mincola, New England's leading natural health care expert. Join me for an all-day muscle testing intensive seminar on Saturday, May 14th at the Angels of Light Healing and Intuitive Center in Normal, Massachusetts. Come learn my EMT muscle testing system firsthand. Find out more about your body's bioenergetic strengths and weaknesses and learn how to tailor a nutrition and wellness plan that better suits your body's personalized needs. For more information, call 781-834-2728. That's 781-834-2728 or log on to MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Come learn to maximize and personalize your wellness. You know, when most people hear the word allergies, they think only of hay fever-like symptoms associated with airborne pollen, dust, and mold. But did you know that many experts estimate that between 60 and 80 million of us suffer from immune-related food allergies without even knowing it? Furthermore, food allergies often contribute to serious health problems such as autism, irritable bowel syndrome, ADD, headaches, and chronic ear infections. Now, there's an effective way to identify and eliminate both your food allergies and the troubling symptoms that they aggravate. Allotest Medical Labs at foodallergy.com offers a full complement of clinical, environmental, and food allergy testing to help you get to the root of your allergy problems. Allotest also provides you with a comprehensive rotation diet, lifestyle book, and a wallet card to help you live food allergy free and stress free. Do you wonder if you or your loved ones are among the 60 to 80 million food allergy sufferers in America? If so, log on to Allotest Medical Labs, foodallergy.com. Talk to your doctor about ordering a food allergy test from Allotest Medical Labs today. Foodallergy.com. Make sure the food you're eating isn't what's depleting you. Now, back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. Mark Mincola and Catherine Foley alongside here on the Natural Health Show. Our phone number is in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless, lucky guys, free call pound, pound 96.9. And uh, Catherine, we were, uh, before we get back to calls here, we were chatting uh, or weaving in and out here talking about right. the important topic as we do each and every Sunday night. And tonight's topic, we're talking a little bit about probiotics. Mm -hmm. And you just came back from Washington and uh, got right. the latest cutting edge uh, research information uh, regarding probiotics. A lot of folks out there really interested in knowing, you know, what what is 
uh, the benefit, for example, what what can it help? What can it help with when someone uses a good culture, a good probiotic culture? Uh, what kind of sicknesses? What kind of conditions? Talk about that a little bit. Well, you know, for women's health, women um, struggle. Many women struggle with repeated and vicious cycle uh, yeast infections. Yep. What, in actuality, is the new science and the new research is that because this is one of the only conditions that we is most frequently self-diagnosed yes that women are often misdiagnosing and they are misdiagnosing a yeast infection from huh. a bacterial infection and so what is really happening is that women are self-diagnosing as a yeast infection going out getting fungal sides using the treatment and the bacteria that are really causing the problem create a bigger infection right so then you treat the bacterial infection and the yeast infection goes back so it's creating a vicious cycle the probiotic bacteria that we have in femdophilus are active against yeast and bacteria that cause bacterial vaginosis and this is extremely important because you know this is really dangerous for women to be constantly battling right. bacterial infections and then also the fact that they're they're misdiagnosing. The symptoms of a bacterial infection mimic and are very similar to the symptoms of a yeast infection. So when you're self-diagnosing, there's really no way to know. Nowadays, um, when you go to a pharmacy like CVS or Walgreens, Monistat comes with a test kit now. Oh, wow. And that's an indicator to people out there that, you know, they're aware of the issue mm -hmm. and they need to encourage their consumers to make sure they're using the product appropriately. So use that as an indicator of that this is very actually important. a very big problem in yep. women's health. So the the product that you're talking about, the Femdophilus, F-E-M, Dophilus, Femdophilus mm -hmm. is a jar of formulas product, of right. course. But uh, so for for those women who suffer from recurrent yeast infections, right. uh, vaginal infections, urinary tract infections. Right. Now, what about what about um, kids, for example, that right. have uh, a lot of uh, well. You know, bladder infections right. and sinus infections. Absolutely. There's a probiotic strategy there, too. What would that be? You know, using, especially for young girls, too, young girls, a uh, you know, good friend of ours, a friend of mine that I had see you because um, her and her daughter had Lyme right. disease. Yep. Um, you know, her daughter was having some yeast problems, and, you know, we gave her Femdophilus, and it, it really turned her around very quickly. So, you know, for, for young kids, it depends, again, on what, you know, what you're struggling with and to look at the bacteria that are in the product and make sure that they address the issues that you're dealing with. So whether it's yeast infections, bacterial infections, um, UTIs and kidneys, a good bacteria is going to be studied for all of those things and have the good clinical backing for all of those things. On Jaro Formulas, what makes our probiotics really unique is you'll see strain numbers. It's the bacteria, the name of the bacteria, and then a number after mm -hmm. it. Yep. And that links it to the clinical studies that, you know, we're using to support the product and the science behind Great. the product. So this is how to look for a good probiotic. And not to leave the gentleman out here. I mean, <laughs> no, someone the, asked me if we had Mandophilus. Mandophilus, that's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe someday. Dude Dophilus, Dude right? Do oh, <laughs> All right, so here's the thing I have. A, here's, a, here's the question that I want to, uh, to raise here. Yeah. You know, so many folks have bloat right okay and i constantly explain all week long to patients that yeah. a lot of bloating you know again we're talking about folks that aren't overweight folks that don't need to lose weight but look like they need to lose yeah. weight that is probably one of the top three complaints that i hear throughout the course of the year right and i'm always reminding people that it's typically about yeast it's typically about what does yeast do to bread folks it makes it rise it's a fermentation process it makes your tummy rise as well so there are folks out there who uh, may just happen to be gentlemen Mm -hmm. But men or women that could benefit from a good culture to help get this bloat down, you'd recommend what culture? Uh, the EPS, which EPS, is EPS, that's our what I recommend probiotic. all week long. Yep. So EPS is a great anti-bloating formula. Jarodophilus. Jarodophilus, yeah, another one. So um, these cultures are really, really important to help you to break down some of that inflammation that is bacterial and that uh, gives the uh, stomach that kind of inflammatory bloated look. Uh, Listen, these these guys, these bacteria, we would not be alive without them. And we're really starting to learn some of the science and research that 
um, these bacteria, the metabolites that they produce, they are our final stage of digestion. They're what we call microdigestion. Without microdigestion, you cannot absorb right. the things that you need from your food stuff. So it, they're very, very, very important. Right, we better get to our callers. So we got Kathleen in the line from Danvers. Welcome to 96.9 Boston. Hi. Talk to you on the Natural Health Show. Hey, um, I... I love your show. Only one complaint. It's not on long enough <laughs> or often enough. Aren't really, you, it's very nice. helpful. And, um, and you're saving us all co-pays and unnecessary medicines. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, I want to know for the ETS, where do you, is that only at the Good Health Food Store? EPS? EPS is out there. It's, it's it, everywhere. Yeah, because, because <laughs> oh. of Catherine Foley, it's out there. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, you can find it at... Uh, you know, most of your major health food stores, you're in Danvers. Um, so. Yeah, the uh, Vita Shop, Vitamin Shop A. Or? Ha- yep, yep, yeah. I have that Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, great. And then my other question was, now that we're thinking about the summer, finally, eventually, uh, what do you, what can you recommend, anything for reducing brown spots or in also sunscreen? Well, yeah, absolutely. Use your, um, you know, sunscreens and, you know, anything, the age spots are actually when Pro- you have... Peroxide, right? Yeah, when you have skin damage. Yeah, free radical peroxides. Yeah. Um, I, back to a couple other products, NAC, for example. That's what I was going to say. Yeah, yeah exactly. I, I could sense that's what you were about to say. <laughs> but anyway, there's a product called NAC, N-acetylcysteine, which will kick up your glutathione levels and help you deal with those peroxides. So, you know, the sunscreen's one thing. Uh, make sure you're doing something natural like Burt's Bees or something like that because yeah. there's a lot of junky products out there. And Kathleen, the, the NAC, N-acetylcysteine, cysteine supports um, liver health and your liver's ability to produce these enzymes like Mark was talking about, glutathione, that help combat the damage caused by free radicals, right. which is UV damage on the skin. Right. One last thing I would say about that is if you read Joanna Budwig's work, she was nominated for seven Nobel Prizes, mm-hmm. and she talks about the importance of not blaming the sun entirely right. here, that the sun is, is bombarding you with electrons, and it's only when you don't have enough electron receptors to, to balance and manage all that electron bathing yeah. that you're getting. Uh, that you run into problems. And she goes on to talk extensively about the importance of omega-3s for that very thing. Exactly. So make sure you're taking your flax or your fish oils uh, on a regular basis as well. I am, thanks to you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now I'll go out and get the other things too. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you so much. Okay. You know, Bye-bye. You know, Mark, we make a product called Skin Optimizer. Oh, yes. And um, it has an ingredient in there called glycodin, and it's a particular type of SOD that Superoxide dismutase. Um, right. That is in some of the cosmetics out there. It's um, an enzyme catalase. Yeah, and it has been shown in clinical studies to increase your um, exposure rate to the sun. So your response to UV light, it's like a natural sunscreen. Sure. You know, and your body should be able to tolerate it, but it's dependent on how healthy things like your liver and right. things like this are. So. Absolutely true. And uh, let's see, we've got Mary on the line from Hall. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talks. You're on the Natural Health Show. Hi, good evening to you both. Yeah, thanks for taking my question. Great shows always. I have to thank you, Mark, for years ago suggesting I eliminate yeasted products from my diet, which has, I mean, I'm like a whole new person, and I think diet is so key. Oh, so what you're discussing tonight, it really does work. Um, and But the reason I was calling is because for the second time in his 15 years, my son is uh, on amoxicillin for an ear infection. So it's only twice in his life on an antibiotic, which is a pretty good record, I think. I think you're doing something right. But Well, thanks. But however, uh, I, I, I do have him on Jaro plus FOS, plus FOS, uh, is that the correct blend for him? So to keep the um, you know, so to keep the good bacteria healthy. Yeah, I think that's a good a good blend for him. Um, you know, we have we have the ultra gyrodophilus, which is a little bit of a higher potency, and, okay. and that may be good for him while he's on the antibiotics um, because the antibiotics are killing so many of the good bacteria while he's right. he's on the course. Um, sure. So I would maybe use that while he's on the antibiotic therapy. Can you say it again? The ultra? Ultra? Okay. Gyrodophilus. And should he take, space it about two hours apart from the antibiotic, would you say? You know what? Our our doctors up at in Institute Roselle in Montreal have said that if even if he takes it at the same time, the travel rates for antibiotics are 
are quite different than just regular capsules. Okay. So they would actually get to the intestine and in the, the antibiotics release in the stomach. So they get to different places at right. different times. So if the compliance is better for him to take it at the same time, then... No problem. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it, the only thing that's um, symptom-wise is it's taking the ear a while to clear in terms of the ability to hear. So is there anything... I'm actually giving him mullen as well. For uh, I, would, I would tell you that one, one of the most important things that I'd recommend would be colloidal silver drops in uh, the ear. I agree. Okay. I okay. Agree. In addition to these things. Yes, indeed. I okay. And uh, do you seem to find that these these things do take a while to clear up, even maybe after the bi antibiotic treatment? N well, no. I think that um, it depends on what your strategies are. I think that by bringing colloidal silver drops in, I mean, uh, I just <laughs> recently uh, my my uh, son's little guy just had mm -hmm. uh, a little ear infection, and and uh, he actually put the um, the um, uh, Oh, no, the oregano drops. Uh, the oregano uh, drops in uh, his ear, and the oregano drops seem to work within a matter of days. Wonderful. So yeah. you know, I think there are natural, uh, liquid-based anti antibiotics. I should say uh, probiotics or natural antibiotics mm -hmm. that actually help you to, you know, kill off these some of these strains and uh, in safe measure. I think uh, I'd recommend either or for for him. He's 15. Yes. That's correct. Huh? Yeah. Use and the use the oregano and or the colloidal silver drops in the ear. I think you'll see a big difference. How many drops of you know either of those would you? Uh, it doesn't take much. Four drops twice a day. Four drops three times a day. Okay, whether it's the colloidal or the oregano, yep. that, that will do. Great. Well, thank you so much for your, your time and your help. Well, well thanks for calling, and I'm glad you're uh, doing so well. Thank you so much. You All guys right. have a great day. Thanks, you bye too. Bye-bye. So um, the ultra. Yeah, ultra gyrodophos. The ultra gyrodophos seems to be the right answer. It's a high potency, and, you know, the, yeah, it's important when you're taking things like antibiotics um, to get exposure to as many bacteria as you possibly can because they, the anti. I mean, it says it right in the name, antibiotic. It, it kills the bacteria in your intestinal. Great advice. And we're going to take an ultra break. We'll be right back. <laughs> if you're talking about it, we're talking about it. Your talk. Your talk. Your talk. 96.9 Boston Talks. Michael Graham. President Obama. He's the feeling commander. Feeling uncomfortable after eating? Then colon hydrotherapy may be the solution for you. Solving your digestive issues such as constipation and ridding your body of toxins accumulated from processed food in the environment. Internal Wellness Center located in Data Mass offers the best in colon cleansing using the FDA approved Angel of Water system. A certified therapist at Internal Wellness Center will guide you through the procedure while maintaining your privacy. Call 781-329-3800. That's 781-329-3800. Visit their website at internalwellnessctr.com. Make plans now to attend the Healthy Living Expo on May 21st at the Wellesley Community Center to chat with the folks at Internal Wellness, as well as 30 other vendors in the health and wellness field. Their purpose is to help you bring prosperity, health, and balance to your life. But you have to show up to make it happen. That's the Healthy Living Expo in Wellesley on May 21st from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the Wellesley Community Center. MyHealthyLivingMag.com. That's MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Tired of one-size-fits-all nutrition and wellness plans? Would you like to have a customized plan for you and you alone? Now you can learn a remarkable bioenergetic system that enables you to effortlessly self-analyze and customize your own nutrition and wellness. Hi, I'm Mark Mincola, New England's leading natural health care expert. Join me for an all-day muscle testing intensive seminar on Saturday, May 14th at the Angels of Light Healing and Intuitive Center in Normal, Massachusetts. Come learn my EMT muscle testing system firsthand. Find out more about your body's bioenergetic strengths and and weaknesses and learn how to tailor a nutrition and wellness plan that better suits your body's personalized needs. For more information, call 781-834-2728. That's 781-834-2728 or log on to MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Come learn to maximize and personalize your wellness. You know, a couple of years ago, I told you that I started going to Dr. Ryan Johnson from Newton Prosthodontics after I read about him in the Best of Boston edition of Boston Magazine. Then I got Graham to go and I thought that was an odd couple, but now we have a menage a trois, Michael Andelman. <laughs> you know, I've been putting off going to see a dentist, I'm ashamed to say. Eight years. That's how long it's been since I've been should to be a really dentist. should be really proud of yourself. You're I heard you reading the ads. I heard Michael Graham reading the ads for Dr. Ryan Johnson. I called his office, and three minutes later, he called me on his personal cell phone and said, come to my office tomorrow. And I said, well, I'm working really early. He goes, be at my office at 645. He was there. I got my appointment done. I've been there a couple times to get my work done. I've never had 
better customer service in any industry, not in anything close. It's the best experience I've ever had, Dr. Ryan Johnson. Dr. Ryan Johnson, you can find him. You can be like the three of us at newtonprosthodontics.com, or you can call him at 617-965-1225. As Michael would say, remember, see a specialist. The difference will make you smile. Hi, this is Laura from Good Health. Like Good Health Natural Foods, many of the farms we work with are family-owned and operated. For them, as with us, farming and fresh, healthy food is more than a business. It's a passion. Good Health takes great pride in offering only 100% organic produce. We believe supporting local farmers is good for the community, the environment, and all of our families. Good Health partners with the largest organic co-op in New England, and our farms cultivate a diverse assortment of crops each season. Berries, pears, melons, corn, carrots, and spring greens are just some of our delectable offerings. So visit Good Health in Quincy and Hanover today. Try our organic fruits, veggies, and herbs. Our mission is simple, to bring everything farm to table within hours every day. Let our exceptional staff answer questions and make recommendations on how to prepare and enjoy all our local specialties. For store hours and locations, visit GoodHealthNaturalFood.com. Celebrate every season at Good Health. See you soon, and thanks for listening. Now, back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. And we would like to uh, take this time to make sure that we thank the one and only Catherine Foley from Jar of Formulas. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be on. It's and always, it's, a, it's so much fun to have you yeah. here. The repartee, <laughs> it really is. The re, I really enjoy the repartee. It's great stuff. And to be with such a knowledgeable pro is, is all the better. Mm-hmm. And, you know, folks I know are interested in the Rolls Royce of supplements out mm-hmm. there. So tell people how they can get in touch with more Jaro Formulas information. Great. And, guys, it's easy. Jaro.com, J A R R O W.com, and our website. Look for the science reading room and all sorts of other really amazing literature that we have up there. We're all about education, and you can find great resources on our website. And rumor has it you're coming back here May 22nd. We're we going to are. talk about <laughs> vitamin B12. Yes, that's going to be a great show. <laughs> all right, thank you so much for being here thank again, you. and uh, thanks to Good Health Natural Foods for all the wonderful support uh, over the years as well. And uh, just a quick plug for my from moi, Fox 25, <laughs> and my segment uh, on the Fox 25 Morning Show will be 8:50 this coming Thursday. So make sure you tune in for that. We're going to talk about good fat, bad fat, not the kind on the plate, the kind in your body, brown fat, white fat. <laughs> Interesting new research about that. Um, also. Folks interested, as Catherine pointed out earlier, in watching this show, you can actually watch this show or listen back to it on our website. It's podcast. It's recorded. We have archives of all the programs. So check that out at maxhealing.com. We also have a store there. You can purchase some of my books. Uh, You can also... uh, Get in touch with me through Twitter, et cetera, et cetera. So that's going. That's it. Mark Mincola, obviously simple enough. Patrick Stevens, the producer. Thank you so much for your wonderful work tonight. And uh, stay tuned to Woody and Abby Right Turn Radio, New England's number one addiction program. And uh, once again, happy Mother's Day to all out there.